first met with Jim Wong about uh, doing an X-Files episode, I had actually heard of something called misophonia, which is where you're affected by sounds that other people can't hear. Jim kind of liked that idea and sort of did his own take on it. This case begins with uh, Mulder. He knows more than he's letting on to Scully. He chose the most secured place in the building to kill himself trying to access something. Is that where we're here? What are you looking for, Mulder? Scully is going along, investigating a certain aspect of it, and Mulder clearly is on another track. Founder's mutation. The founder is what they call Dr. Goldman at Nugenics. Is that why you wanted to talk to him? I don't think that's the mutation Sanjay was referring to. A founder's mutation is when a species goes through a further step in evolution. There are certain mutations that take place, and they call those changes in DNA founder's mutation. This is what you suspected all along, but were afraid to articulate. Is this what you believe happened to me 15 years ago? Was I just an incubator? Scully, when she jumps on board with Mulder's hypothesis, starts to question whether she has had the wrong idea of where William, her child, has been. It's a clinical setting. It looks like it might be a hospital. The doctor who we first meet in the episode is impacted by sounds that he hears loud and vividly, and no one else can hear them. And we find Mulder starting to be affected by the same thing. Oh, 